What is up guys? We're back down here at the river. We're gonna do a little boat review on the Sea Eagle 285. Let's see what happens. My anchor. I picked up this rope from Walmart. I think it was like 249 or Alright, to tie this off guys, this is all good. Wrap it around a couple times. Go in through the loop and back through the loop. And pull it down. And I don't think she's gonna go anywhere. We got her all together. We're about to get in the water. Man, I just gotta say, this thing looks amazing. What I did right here is I put a little milk crate and I zip tied my GoPro selfie stick to it. Maybe I can get some better angles for y'all. But man, this thing looks good. Let's see how she does. All right, guys. We're going down the river right now. The only thing I don't like about this boat so far is how the wind pushes around. But I, I expected that. Um, being such a light boat, it's got no, no way to track underneath the boat. It's just smooth pontoons. But I'm on three right now, and this is a 30 pound thrust. Minn Kota. And I mean, it seems to be doing really good. Let's Bump her up a little bit, see how we go. Oh, we roll. Let's see if we can't stand up while we're going. Oh yeah, it's it's very stable in the water. Kind of confident, good headwind. This boat's done good. What our battery charge is on. Set a little test button. Three lights. It only goes to four, so I can't complain there. And I didn't charge it the last time I used it, so. Not Alright guys, now what I'm doing is get up above where I want to fish and I'm just going to float down and fish all of this right here. See if we can't hook on something nice. We probably, I don't know, probably a half a mile from the truck up the river. And for some reason, the motor has just been I've checked all my connections. I've checked my battery. My battery is at the same place it was. Oh, never mind, it dropped one bar. But the motor should still run on that. So, we're gonna have to figure that out. I mean, we do got paddles on this thing. I'd rather not paddle all the way back down there, but at least I'm not downriver. I'm upriver, so I can just float back down and kind of steer it with the paddles as I go. But, man, that's a bummer. Alright guys, this moment, I'm not gonna lie, I felt like just paddling all the way back and just giving up. It's been a long day, I bird nested my ride back my first cast, and it was a horrible one. And I was just, honestly, I was just feeling sorry. So, my little arms were burning, my shoulders were burning, my back was feeling it. Man, it was just... I really did. I felt sorry for myself. And I stopped and thought, and I was like, man, I was like, I'll come all the way up here. And I'm just going to give up and go back because of my anger. Because I let my anger get the best of me. I'm going to go all the way back. Nah. Not that easy. Yeah. My motor is broke. And 
I might be getting hot, but things could always be a lot worse. I could be swimming down this river instead of rowing down this river. It took me a long time to not let my anger drop my emotions. And every now and then I do slip up. We all slip up. But just sometimes you just gotta sit back, take a deep breath, and throw your line in the water. And whatever happens, happens. today boy. You might not be a monster, but hey, it's better than nothing. Hey! Boy, am I glad to see you. Uh oh. Got one, boys. Oh, decent fish right here. Oh. Oh. Alright guys, this is what I was throwing today, a little black and blue jig with a black and blue uh, creature tail on it and a watermelon chartreuse tip Sanko. A little bullet sinker. And I do want to say that I bought this boat used. So the Minn Kota motor was used. It looked really good and I tested it out whenever I bought it but I mean there's only so much you can do whenever you meet up in a parking lot and buy a boat but hey I mean it is what it is um, I got an amazing boat for a very good price um, I mean I would highly recommend this especially if you're in really tight waters and need to go into little itty bitty places because this thing turns on a dock um, if you're running river currents like I am I would probably get a little bit stronger Trolling motor, but got one, boy. that's your truck. But Man, don't sleep like, on um, Encoda just because mine stopped like working. It was it. you. Heck yeah. Can't beat that, boy. Yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. Um, I'm probably gonna do another review with another motor once, whenever I get the time. Um, yeah, I mean, caught a couple good bass, um, had a good trip, beautiful day, can't complain. Thanks for watching. If you ain't already subscribed, hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, and hit that notification bell so you get notified every time I post videos. But thanks for watching.